All right, everyone, welcome back once again. We've got our feet squared away. They're they're standing on solid ground, at least we hope. And, uh, yeah, we're just making ourselves here at home in cartoonography. Let's uh, hope that we can do it justice. Um, so what's on tap for today? We found our, our starting location. We've got the starts of a little beginning base and we need to kind of do a bit of juggling as we go now um, between overworld getting all those base supplies that we need and um, getting down there or any other caves that we can find to Uh, square away with where we're at. So, with that in mind, how are our tools doing? Shovels are not so hot. We've got a few axes. Could use one more pick. Let's go ahead and make that. So yeah, loads of stuff to get done, and that being said, we're going to hop in our boat and, uh, Go for a little putter around here. Hadn't even really noticed or, or taken note of, like we went right by it, that we are right on the edge of some nice sugar cane too. So we'll have that ready for us. Um, but this plane right on our waterway is nice. And it is equally nice to have dark forest here at our fingertips gotta be a little careful here especially early in the game um, creepers and skellies from everywhere they love to hide in this stuff tall trees So just getting a lot of base wood will be big help. Um, obviously, we want the wood. Keep working on our little uh, starter home here. Uh, but in addition to that, uh, if we don't find any more here, we can uh, turn some of this into charcoal and get more torches because we're down to three, <laughs> which is not real good. We may have a few more in another stack. I can't remember if we already merged those or not. Honestly. All right, good to have all of those. Now, eventually, uh, we'll kind of do some rhyme or reason to, you know, angle through these forests. Presumably, uh, we'll have some roads on out to the plains and, um, you know, kind of back to all the features around spawn. But... I... I'm kind of okay with just pushing the edge here since it will be on area that we could conceivably be using for crops or anything else. So uh, no, no real worries about just cutting along this edge. All right, so what does that give us? Stacking a bit of dark and then some regular...
kind of like to keep the didn't do a very good job of watching that um, kind of like to keep the regular coming as much as it can these massive trees a couple more that I'd really like to see but can complain all we want it's not going to change anything uh, just will be more problematic in uh, the uh, leaf decay. I knew it. I heard him. But then I hadn't seen him. So let's go explore this way. See what we got. Ooh. Uh, yeah. Aside from that, <laughs> pretty ideal. Uh, that is uh, it's a bit of a challenge. I mean, it, it's nothing, right? We just throw some dirt in there. Oh, good. We've certainly done that before. This looks raviney. What I did not do was load my bed, so we have to be very careful about being able to get back home again. And, of course, not a drab of coal. Or iron, for that matter, but... Neither one in that little area. This just ends up at the lake. The lake would not appear to be a waterfall into a deep cavern. Checking these little outcrops here. Sometimes you'll get a little blurb. Does, I did not have more just sitting in my inventory either. Figured we should probably check that. Alright, let's uh, head for home then. This is totally unnecessary. Just peeking around, see if there's any caves or anything like that that can be readily exploited here in the daytime. Lots and lots of cows. Very nice to see them. Oh yeah, this went nowhere any... Oh, here we go. Oh, good. Trade one for multiple. I gotta keep my eye out, though. It's one of the worlds that we lost in a similar... This is always the way it's like, I want the coal. I'm thrilled that this vein is as big as it is, but it always happens, right? As you know, the day is getting short and you got to get home and it's like, come on, stop. Just too much coal. 
There we go. We got plenty of time. Uh, what I said they don't see in this forest river is the salmon bounty that we had outside our last base. That was certainly a great way to start. Okay. Now we have... I'm going to have to put a few in. We're not going to cook more glass until we are a little better off. Um... Birch would be the easiest to replenish. Let's. Oh, we may want that for more walls and stuff. I don't know. Let's just make these into more sticks. All right, there we go. Now. More doors. Bunch of dark. And I don't know that this is going to be... super special, but it's better than dirt and mismatched stones. that one. That can all be wrapped up in a bit. And now without worry of lack of torchlight or any other such trivialities, we can out here. Now, honestly, not not the biggest priority, right? But in doing this, we can build some chests and start placing them without knowing. Oh, I'm gonna break this stuff almost immediately because I, it's revolting. That kind of deal. Um, at least that's my thought anyway is get this down we can start then arranging uh, intermediate storage and our basic crafting kind of setup now what we I think 
I might kick those doors and make that a three one to there. Do this all in together. on hand, so we gotta go get some of that. exactly yet, but yeah, just extra torches all around. Make it look light and bright and beautiful. All right, now this has to come out for the door. This has to get swapped. And then we had torches. Oh, we can, yeah, we can't do them there. We should be very well lit. Cool. Well, that, that makes me feel better. This is going to make me feel better still. So, what I'm initially thinking here is we do, as I said, you know, maybe this becomes our. Our typical space right and that's exactly why I kicked these out was to have the three on a side so we could do just a, a much bigger version but I'm wondering if we don't do um, Just some amplified storage where we would have oh, I don't know. Sorry, hit the mic. With 24, we could do an 
and that would give us all our our normal storage spaces um, but kind of unnecessarily because then what I'm thinking is man we are a mess for wood is that we would lift this do one here and one there and maybe inset our crafting table And then we could do up another furnace that we won't have fuel to run yet, but and we could even do that under here. So we've got just a wider expanse down there. So this gives us uh, a little crafting and tool side, and I kind of think that could be our. Our normal first chest, right? We can we can kind of start loading it up with the things we do have here. Not much to put in it because we need everything at the moment. We can put these extra doors in. That'll make us feel good. And then we don't need these two. And then this can be kind of our wood supplies, just as it normally would be. Not that we have a lot of logs at this point, but uh, certainly all our samplings and things can go in here. All right. Then for the moment, I know I just grabbed those out, but let's leave them. Uh, let's, well, let's take these. Uh, what I kind of think is I'd like to do the same thing back over on this side and make it like a, a food prep area. Which certainly wouldn't give us everything that we, you know, in terms of needing all this stuff. But we can put some ovens over there and... Set all this up. Oh, that was the door that we just put away. Some of this we already have done. I don't know how much of this whole upper part we did. Some. Not all, though. So we can at least go back the three of the wall we need all these supplies guys that's what we're going to focus on this episode is just getting supplies not at all on building <laughs> This is the problem. It really does lull you into a complacency. I'm not even thinking about the fact that I have no armor. Anything could just wander on up and wreck my day. And that I really need as sad as it is. Let's get at least as much of this going as we can. Not just completely waste our coal. That's only one down, so that's okay. 
Oh, here. Do these two. We'll put them in. Did I hang the door? I don't think I did. All right, good. Now, what do we have? That never got adjusted. And it goes there. This should all be... Well, I don't know. This one isn't nearly the side of the hill that the other is. Let's maybe take a couple of those for windows, and then we can just do the rest of this into the wood. This is the part I don't mind not pushing too hard because I really don't don't know. I do like the idea of it going up higher as well. Uh, of course, this messes up all the torch lines we had had. Oh well. Okay, well, that's that's good enough for now. What we sadly need are a couple torches right in the middle here. Keep us safe and sound. And then we need this glass. This glass. And we need to specifically break that pane try to get these swapped out here, but okay, that's closed and secure. There weren't many of these left. I just I'd rather have them done and solid the same than some of this stuff that's easy to ignore. Getting closer. All right, half dozen or so more glass, and we'll be be really good. Okay, well now food boxes can go over there. Again, we aren't going to have the. hole to do anything with these, but Let's start off at least with a couple of furnaces. Mm -hmm. And I kind of like, uh, Something or other up above. Eventually, maybe some smokers and things just to mix it up a little bit. But this can be our our little kitcheny area, and as such, we can do uh, everything here is not going to be prepared food yet. 
but well, I can put bread. So we got raw ingredients, you know, whatever we want to cook up. We'll then have another chest to overflow with cooked foods. So that that kind of frees up the rest of these to become um, overflow. And in our regular layout, we're going to have, you know, if... if tools and wood are already taken, then this, which can all be allocated, can become dirt and gravel. Um, I think that's reasonable. This would be maybe treasure and other more custom items as we get them early. And then on this side, we can do one for all of these and then a couple for cobble and we've got three for the randomings of the world does that sound and we've even got a random extra chest we can do with later there we go now we got a lot of tools to replace uh, let's check the time here. 31 minutes, not too shabby. We don't have any means yet to... Well, we don't even know where... Stop worrying about that. Do not need to concern ourselves with, uh, with expanding into an upstairs. Now i got to remember where... <sighs> where everything is. No, we need shovels. And maybe that'll get us by for a minute. Alright. We've got torches. Now comes the... the piece that we really... hope... Ooh, already getting good. Doesn't kill us. handle this. Well, I think I can handle it, I should say. Um, ooh, 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 ooh. Not what we want. Okay, if possible, we'll just edge out this entire wall. some hideous here. Ah. The, uh. <sighs> Already Enderman. That's lovely. Alright. So this gets us kind of a mini cellar. Can we go one more? Grr. Probably where it be, starts to become a real bad idea. Just got a peek though. that to there and pop this down and now what I'm thinking ooh, don't like that don't even really like that
this, just trim here and there. So I don't want this to become cramped, so I don't think I want to take that in too far. So now, let's do it again, if possible. Always wanted oak stairs. Don't know that twenty will quite be enough, but Hey, it will be. Oh, this is going to be so nice to have. All right. Still got planks. Good there. Now, we're still kind of pushing our luck here, based on all the groans and moans, but... We clearly will risk a lot for this iron. I'm not going to learn the... Is that all we've got? I was like, oh, we can use all this granite. Good use for it. Um... doing that because I don't know how far we'll go and it's kind of nice to just extend down the corner of it a bit. I'm not trying to make this overly decorative. I just want to maximize this hole and kind of get a spot down here from which we could really start our uh, shot down to the mine. So this, this room fits that bill, I think. Next greatest priority. All right, now, cobble. those for more tools. These back. Nope. 
these two go away. We need two more. All right, good there. Um, let's just, should we just go? We got torches. And yeah, let's uh, see if we can't do it right here. idea where our zombie friends are hanging out. And we'll see what kind of fortune we can have in terms of abandoned mine shafts right at our feet. As I've said at times, it feels like you can't uh, can't go far without hitting one. But we've certainly proven other, you know, in just in tunneling through, we've certainly run into some, but, uh, it, you know, there have been tunnels and directions and things when we haven't, so. <sighs> well, lasted. Oh, no. No, 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 my friend. No. Um, what does that do? Don't miss that jump. Oh, what I'm trying to do is bring them up. <sighs> Gotta get rid of that torch. Stop. Just a hole. Uh, now I've got a glaring scar in my staircase already. That's lovely. thunder out there. thought that was sounding a little gusty, but there were people like happily talking outside my door. Got a nice little sprinkle yesterday. It cooled everything off. It was very nice. And then I did, uh, did go for a nice evening walk. Not quite as big as the, uh, the hike I went on the other day. And, uh, I, I actually kind of felt it more because I was wearing, for the first one, since it was unplanned, I was uh, just wearing sandals. And that worked out fine. It left me more foot sore or, like, foot weary than I have been in a while. Um, but I kind of kind of thought that was all right. You know, it, it wasn't, like, blistery, right? And that's... That's a big difference, I think. 
Um, I guess here we go. Let's see what else we come across. But hopefully, you know, as we always hope in these these early build projects, coal and iron. Any that cross our path, we'll just uh, scoop on up. Um, but we'll also, with frequent stone tool resets, we'll run upstairs. I'd like to go get wood um, as well, more oak. I think we'll just continue that oak theme for the stairs. And then if we need it, we'll use cobble or something down at the bottom. Do we need endless gravel right here? <sighs> this is massive. That's our outer line. I don't want to undo too much, or have to do undo too much. So I think I'll just backfill to behind where we'll eventually have decorative stone cut, or decorative something or other. So that would go there, there. Oh, we just did it. And there, and this is our our regular cut line. One out from that. So if these are set, so we leave those. Everything else uh, should fall along. I don't know if any of that made anybody sense to anybody, but in my brain, it's crystal clear. If I managed it right. Now, while this is the time I'd love to run back up and check for daylight, since I think it's there, I do want to make this part clear. Oh, and we got to coal. So, some kind of other stone can use some of this where if that'll even help fill in there we go and right back on with our nice uniform staircase down and then here we aren't low enough yet so let's do one more out to the coal those torches to there. And boom. Like it never even happened. Alright. Now you you and we got a gravel box. Uh, let's make this the gravel. 
until we know otherwise, we'll keep Flint. And at least, well, we don't we aren't that worried about it. Um, an axe. Still have no real grasp. All right, so that's looking south. That's all I need to know. West to here. Didn't I, didn't I just park the boat out here? What happened to the boat? Something steal my boat? Um. As I recall... Why would I put the boat in the chest when I can just put the boat in the water? And now the boat's gone. But, I mean, sometimes squid or something will push it a little ways, but I don't see it anywhere. Anybody see a boat? Alright, well, this is keeping us off track. I guess we just gotta swim. And some salmon. Again, it's not, not the salmon super habitat. Oh, there's the boat. So I also brought it over here and then toured around. My fault. Are you... I got a little bit of time. i make the most of it. just makes this dark forest that much more dangerous. I tell ya. Come on. No. Bad spider. We've learned our lesson from the last world, or at least I'm going to try to, and that is no way do we sit around. A piece of string is not worth that when it hit me from behind and we had nothing in armor. And that just tells me exactly what I was already saying about the dark forest and the rain. We can't do it. So we'll do better things. Like forge stuff out of this awesome iron that we have. And forge wood out of this awesome couple logs. Alright. Shield. We hate it, but we gotta have it. Uh, with ten... It, the, the best... The best double you can do is the five and four and get the hat and boots, but you don't... Uh, I'll show you in the you remember, we're going to get shirts down there when we put on our iron, right? So, when we get that out of the way, we get three shirts out of that. Combined, the hat and boots don't give us three. Remember, we're going to stay stay short. I think the, uh, the pants give you like another two and a half. And then the hat and the boots, something more there. Uh, but the, I believe the shirt is the big, big kicker there. So we've got a couple more to use as soon as we uh, come across more goodies. Now, let's go ahead and repair what tools we have. I don't know if I like that turn. And these can go together. There we go. Yeah, I think, since we're not, we 
least in better time. I think we go ahead and do that here and the tool chest there. I'm just too used to opening this this chest wherever it is and being right there. Okay, back over to here. Dump box. Uh, food box is in here. Again, changing stuff I normally don't, so forgive the uh, back and forth for a bit. All right, Joey, have you close to a single stack there? Get our shield ready to go. Uh, well, we're marginally less vulnerable. Still don't like that. Just a rumbler outside this afternoon. May have to go take a peek at the end of this episode. Speaking of which, 56 minutes, not bad. Um, yeah, why don't we uh, why don't we wrap up? We'll give all you hangers on through the end a little bit of assurance when we go under an hour and everybody else thinks I lost another world. I admit it, you guys would think I would too. I know, I would think I would. But uh, no, we're just keeping a close eye on the clock. So let's uh, go ahead and save this one. We, an, another good progress. We kind of got our home functional now and are starting down to uh, to the real just. We're seeing enough salmon in the water that maybe we can uh, produce a few more of those. But... Um, like I said, it's storming out. It's uh, kind of into evening time. I'm not sure. Uh, as always, when I'm starting worlds, I'm kind of like, yeah, let's go. Um, but may may wrap it up. You may see more from me later tonight. But uh, otherwise, uh, there will be more coming soon. I hope you guys are enjoying. Please let me know in the likes and comments if you think we're off to a great new world or you think we have no chance of catching up to where we'd... Uh, where we'd been at in vanilla brewed coffee, much less slow cooker uh, with this guy. We'll see how it plays out, but uh, I'd love to have you along for the ride. Come on back, and we'll see you next time. Till then, take care. Oh, I didn't even give you the, there it is. Thank you. Uh, see you next time.